Hey everyone. Nice junk. So anyways, you're wondering why I'm in the truck. Well, we're on our way to Tabor, Alberta to pick up the auction windows. So, just thought it'd be a great time to discuss the uh, 500 to 5,000 uh, contest or 500 beavers contest. So well, basically, I reach 5,000 subscribers. I put out a contest for $500 Canadian cash and a weekend with nice junk in Beaver, Utah. Now, so what I need you guys to do is to like do the social media sharing on the face pages, on the TikToks, Twitter, oh no. Now it's X. So on your X's, Instagrams, just share it out everywhere. Tell your friends, hey, you wanna see a totally in-depth person doing stupid stuff, most of the time with the wrong tools, and for no real apparent reason, check this guy out. Tell him to subscribe. It might be it might make you $500 richer. And if you don't want to go to Beaver, don't worry. You don't have to. I'll just send you 500 bucks. That makes everybody in the world eligible for at least $500. And what I'll do is I'll get a mannequin. I'll write your name on them. And I'll take them to Beaver. And so you're like there. And I'll just do a whole video on our trip to Beaver, either with you or with a mannequin. That's a pretty good deal. Anyways, see you in Tabor. Load that stuff up, and then we're gonna probably scrap something out. And we're gonna scrap this refrigeration unit that I got from the auction. Pay two bucks for it. So, as long as there's $2 worth of goodies in there, we win. We're back from the auction. Here's this big refrigeration unit. It's heavy. I'm by myself. So we're going to unload it nice junk style. As you can see, we unloaded that big thing there. Um, I just wanted to go over some of the stuff I got. So these high bay lights. I got six of those for um, two dollars. I got um, this compressor, two sets of gauges and torches for uh, cutting, and this weed whacker for twenty-two bucks. So I got that welder with all the cables for $22. So now it's just time to unload it. So what we got today is a Gardner Denver refrigerated air filter. I don't know. Maybe if you can bleep bloop in the comments why you would need such a thing and what's the purpose. That would be awesome. But I've never seen one before. So this thing is heavy, as you can see by the unload. And in here, there's a big compressor and a little rad. 
And I'm thinking the top piece here, there must be some goodies in there. And so we're gonna start with top going down. And uh, let's just see what's in here, in this thing. Let's just see what's in this thing. Well, so far, pretty uneventful. Ooh, use copper supply wires only. I like the sound of copper. Great circuit board, a little bit of electrical wire, an aluminum heat sink, and a transformer. Which, so now we're going to take apart these sidewalls. So we got the top off, part of the side. And now we're gonna open up this little box in the back here, see what's inside. It looks like there might be a transformer in there. Let's take a look. It's definitely a lot of wire. Big old transformer, lots of wire, a bunch of doodads. Huh. I think it's worth taking off. But we're gonna throw that in the scrap me later pile. So now we're gonna find out what's in this big, beautiful box of goodness. Bolted it all. It's filled with styrofoam. So guess what? That stays the way it is. Now off to the bottom. So I'm pretty well sure these are steel. But I do know there's some copper. We got her all cut out. Um, this is just your typical refrigeration stuff. Cut the lines, cut the wire, pull it out. I've got the compressor draining so we can uh, uh, process that sealed unit. Some people sell them as sealed units. 
I take the copper out. And here's some number two copper. Do, 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 do. And some uh, prepared steel. So big things are happening at nice junk. Um, I started ordering all my equipment for the um, producing t-shirts for the merch site. That would be nicejunk.ca, but it's not up yet. But it will be very soon. So maybe by the time you see it, it'll be there, so we'll check it out. If not, I'll make a formal announcement anyways on YouTube. And, um, yeah, so we're going to have some t-shirts, uh, probably some baseball hats, mugs, and uh, work gloves. Yeah, nice junk work gloves. I don't know how good they'll be, but they'll be cool because, yeah, my face. And um, eventually... We're going to open it up for wholesale as well. So, meaning that you guys can put your brand on your stuff. I'll produce it, ship it off to you. Or if you need me to just drop ship it straight to your customer, we'll be able to do that too. That's not yet. I want to make sure it's perfected before I offer that service. But anyways, I'm rambling again. So, yeah, I'm driving. But hey, might as well get might as well uh, get six birds with 15 stones while we're doing some aimless driving. So what I want is t-shirt ideas. So make sure to put your submissions into nicejunk666 at gmail.com. So if you didn't catch that, just rewind this video 17 seconds and you can write it because I'll be putting it right here. So that's the story on the nice chunk merch. Next week we'll finish processing the Refrigeration unit, we'll be uh, cutting apart that uh, sealed unit, the radiator, the transformers, blah, blah, blah. So hopefully you enjoyed this episode. Make sure to share, subscribe, like, you know, the, the normal. And we'll see you all next week.